All right, so we're back for Live Request Wednesday, and an interesting one just popped up on the list. This is from a little band called In Hyphen. Now, I'm familiar with a couple tunes from these guys uh, from some of my previous reactions, but I haven't heard them in a while. And uh, this song is called Fever. Came out May 19th, 2021, and has an insane amount of views. It, let me just scroll up. Can you guys see that number? You guys see that number? Yeah, that's, that's wild. Uh, let's check it out. So in hyphen with the song Fever. Oh, if you guys are new around here, please consider liking and subscribing. I always forget to ask people to do that. Here we go. All right, we got ominous piano. Things are looking pretty cinematic here. Warm string section creeping up in the mix. Slow motion running. Fluttering piano. What a dramatic way to start a song. I like how the bell section is almost like a music box. Makes it feel more whimsical. Okay, you officially have my attention. Where is this going? What is happening to him? He's getting lost in smoke? They're having some fun with some of the pitch bend here. That go in his mouth? Who just drops a necklace in somebody's mouth? Did I see that right? Go back a little bit further. Yeah, I'm no nutritionist, but I don't think you're supposed to eat that. You're just probably supposed to keep those things out of your mouth. What a baritone. See, that's why you don't swallow those things. They get stuck around your heart. They're doing some fun things with uh, the, just the bending and, and, and the shifting of the, the frequency and pitch here. It's kind of cool. It's just adding a different like, layer to the whole soundscape itself. 
the beat in the melody so far itself is actually just what seems like almost like a slowed down waltz. Interesting approach here. Interesting texture on the vocals as well. Great harmonies. Um, interesting choreography as well. I'm not exactly sure what's happening here with the storyline, but I'm often confused by these things. So that's a hyphen with the song Fever. Interesting stuff. It's I'm, I'm, I want to go back here to this little intro thing here because I think it ties into the story. But the thing that kind of is almost a little disheartening about this is it's an intro but it seems like the rest of the song doesn't fall for it. It doesn't it doesn't follow in its path. So uh, essentially what it does is it kind of takes you out of the immersion of the song. It doesn't feel like it's one cohesive art piece. It feels like this is two songs in essential. It seems like there's the intro and then there's the song itself. I just wish that they were intertwined better together because there's so many really cool cinematics and so many different like, you know, stingers and hits and stuff like that. They could have added into the actual song itself, but they really didn't. There could have been trickling dancing piano. They could have been all that stuff. But but hey, what do I know? See, it starts off like with what you're like in a world, you know, it kind of had like that, that kind of feeling, you know? But I guess that's, that kind of ties into the storytelling nature of the whole thing. And they are kind of messing with the pitch and the the, uh, the frequency here, here a little bit. But see how warm and wide the string section is here? It feel, like It feels lush. Are they vampires or zombies? And they just go up the scale here. So it leads us to like the feeling of a crescendo. It feels like it's all going towards something. It's building towards something. And it is. Oh, I missed out on the military drums. Forgot about those. And that's where the first half of the song stops. Like that, there's nothing else like this, the first minute of the song in this song. And then it just goes to this. Oh, wait, it's still going. Now it stops. Okay. But do you see what I mean? Completely different atmosphere. Completely different sound textures. The only similarity between the first part of the song and the second part of this song is is literally just mixing, missing with the, the pitch on the song. Mixing, missing with the, the soundscape pitch, which they did a little bit with the cinematics. They're doing a little bit more in the, the uh, electronic side. I like when music has, like, it intertwines together with having a right mix of organics and electronics together. When you do that right, it sounds absolutely fantastic. So I can't help but feel like they left something here on the table because I know this group. I know that they're a vocal powerhouse. In fact, even in this vocal performance here, there was I had no issues whatsoever. Everything was very um, pitch perfect. My only issue here is this song feels like it's not one cohesive piece. I feel like both pieces of the music would have been fine on their own. It just it should have been brought in two different songs. But overall, interesting stuff. Um, and I'm sure there's something I'm just you know, context that I'm missing or whatever. But uh, it feels like this is a little broken up. A little broken up. But nevertheless, and hyphen puts out some interesting music. Good pick on that one. Oh, if you guys are new around here, please consider liking and subscribing, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye, everybody.